I, I, you know, I think, I think too that that's that there's emotion that are connected with music, and it's sort of a feeling uh, that you have connected to. Well, not only the music itself, but the event that you're at or the situation. You see them in concert as opposed to at home. Right, you know, right, right. With right. headphones on at, you know, at two in the morning. And as a teenager, that was sort of a, you, you, those headphone moments. You would sort of, I remember right. hearing, right. Um, there's a band called the Jesus and Mary Chain. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And uh, their music sounds Jeff, a little... did you just say, yes, you have that collection? No, home? I don't have that okay, collection, right, but that I remember them. I remember them, yes. All right. And <laughs> it sounds a little like if you if you cross the Beach Boys with a chainsaw. No, oh, okay. <laughs> so, <If> that happens. <laughs> so there's these sort of like, there, there, there are these sort of, you know, Beach Boy-esque, Beatle-esque melodies buried under just layers of feedback. It's like, right. it's like a, right you know, it's, and, and so there's a song they have called You'll Never Understand Me. I remember as a teenager listening to that, you're right. Sounds no one's true. ever going to understand me. Nobody will. Right. Right. <laughs> and it was, and that was the point. Maybe. It was, it was like, and I, I saw them, uh, I've seen them a concert a couple of times. And uh, first time I saw them was, I saw them at, uh, in Knoxville, Tennessee in 1990. Okay. And uh, I guess I was. There's a memory right yeah, there for you. Right. I guess I was 19 when okay. I saw them, maybe 20. <laughs> and um, so they come into uh, the Knoxville Theater, and, and the opening band was Nine Inch Nails. And so it was yeah. already a little raucous because the lead singer, Trent Reznor of Nine Inch Nails, grabbed the guitarist by the hair and started dragging him around the stage. And oh. I was like, we are not in Kansas we anymore. Are, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're, we're, we're out there now. But when the Jesus and Mary chain came on, first off, before they came on, the, the whole venue filled with smoke. I'm like, what is this? And suddenly I noticed that they were turning all the lights like toward us. And so when they came, it, when they came on, uh, well, first off, before they came on, you were they blinded. Pl- you couldn't see. Right? Well, that, that that was about to happen. They played a video of a song that I'd never heard from them, and they played. I was like, "Why are they playing a video before they come on?" And then the song goes off, smoke rolls in, and suddenly the lights start going in your eyes, so you can't see. You're being disoriented, and the band is just a wall of feedback. You can't tell when the next song begins or ends, and they don't speak. The lead singer sort of sort of just draped over the uh, <laughs> the uh, and he's ah, 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 and they're just you know whatever and they only play for like 30 minutes <laughs> right and and at one point i sort of just turn and see what everybody's doing and everybody's got their mouths open they're going my god what is what, this what? <laughs> and some people are scared <laughs> happening and then suddenly it stops and somehow the smoke is gone and they disappeared and we all just sort of file numbly out of theater that was it what was Concert that? over. And then I, I remember, you know, my girlfriend at the time, and she was like, oh, God, it was horrible. What was that? <laughs> and I thought to myself, that is the greatest That's thing the I've greatest ever thing seen. Ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> that was literally, it was like, wow, that was, yeah. that was perfect. That, yes, okay. <laughs> and you knew she wasn't for you. And uh, she wasn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah that didn't we were, last long, did Because my, my wife actually has seen, seen them twice with me, and she's a Jesus and Mary Chain fan. So that what that is a, uh, okay. there's a point there. There's a compatibility yeah. factor there. I will there. say, kind of they seem thing. to have learned how to play instruments in the time. In the Since then, time. Yes, yes. <laughs> or maybe they, because they're, they're, even though the feedback is still there, there is, you know, they're... They move the guitars away from the speakers. <laughs> Uh, there so was. It, uh, and when I say feedback, happened. I mean ear piercing, not oh, yeah. like, I mean like, like this shrill, oh, make like a dentist drill. 